and in this video lecture I am going to solve this equation so by using the cross multiplication method so let's uh, write the equation first here x by 6 plus y by 15 equal to 4 so first uh, here I am going to do the simplification of this equation so the LCM come 5 and 6 30 and 6 uh, 30 divided by 6 5 come 5 into x 5x thereafter 30 divided with 15 2 come 2 multiply with y 2y this is here 4 ok so here we can write 5x plus 2y equal to 120 now the next is another equation writing here x by 3 minus y by 12 equal to 19 by 4 take the LCM 3 and 4 that sorry 3 and 12 12 come 12 divide with 3 4 come 4 multiply with x 4x and here 12 divide by 12 it come 1 1 multiply with y y thereafter 19 by 4 it cancel by 3 times and here 3 into 19 it come 57 so 4x minus y equal to 57 ok so this two equation that I simplified thereafter we need to calculate the x and y so writing here x uh, so here x so this equation hide for x hide the x part and do the cross multiplication of coefficient of y and the constant term so thereafter here so I'm just removing and here we can write so if 120 move the left side it become minus 57 move on the left side it become minus so minus 120 minus 57 after that here this equation x part that hidden multiply do the cross multiplication of coefficient of y and the constant part so here we can write 2 and here 1 minus 20 sorry minus 120 the x next is minus y is there so we can write y minus 1 here this is minus 57 so here cross multiplication of 2 into minus 57 thereafter minus minus 1 into minus 120 thereafter next is y part so y part next writing the equation here once again 5x 2y minus 120 equal to 0 4x minus y minus 57 equal to 0 so hide the y part so this time this y height write the constant minus 120 by minus 57 here 5 4 so we can write here minus 120 into 4 here minus 5 into minus 57 next here write 1 thereafter write the equation once again so 5x plus 2y minus 120 equal to 0 4x minus y equal to minus 57 equal to 0 so here constant part so this constant we need to hide do the cross multiplication of coefficient of x and y so 5 2 4 minus 1 so 5 into minus 1 minus 2 into 4 okay so let's uh, do the calculation here then, then after you can get the answer so here 57 into 2 this is 14 5 to 10 11 so minus 1 1 4 minus minus plus so it become thereafter minus so here it become minus 120 thereafter write y part minus 120 to 4 minus 480 
thereafter minus minus plus and uh, 57 into 5 7 into 5 35 5 3 5 into 5 25 25 plus 3 28 so this become 28 so 285 thereafter 5 5 into minus 1 that is minus 5 and here this is minus 8 the next is x so here we can write minus 120 1 1 4 so 4 3 2 so this become 2 3 4 minus and here y equal to minus 480 y so here minus 480 2 8 5 so this is here 5 this in 8 minus 1 that is 17 17 and here 9 come this is 3 3 minus 1 1 1 minus 1 9 5 equal to minus 13 so thereafter x part making the relationship 234 by minus 113 minus 13 and next is y minus 195 equal to 1 minus 13 okay so if here so we need to find the value of x and y so 13 into 18 if i multiply 18 into 3 that is 24 4 here 2 8 plus 2 10 okay thereafter 3 1 4 3 2 so now we can write x equal to minus 2 3 4 divided by minus 13 it cancel by 8 times minus minus also plus so x equal to 8 this is the first answer and uh, now here minus 1 9 5 divided by 13 so here this if I multiply 13 into 15 times 5 65 3 1 okay so here wait few second so 65 3 and uh, here let's write y equal to minus 195 divided by minus 13 minus minus plus it cancel by 15 times so y equal to 15 answer so this is the way we can do the cross multiplication of this question so this place don't confuse if i write here 5x plus 2y plus 120 equal to 0 sorry 5x equal to 120 if i move this 120 on the left side so it's, it become 5x 2y minus 120 equal to 0 so directly i did so this is the way we can do the cross multiplication of this equation so i hope guys this video is helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next week thank you